July 6, naglabas ang Interagency Task Force on Emerging Diseases or IATF ng Resolution No. 52. Karamihan sa laban ng Resolution No. 52 ay patungkol sa turismo. Kaya naman mahalaga malaman kung ano ang mga laman ng Resolution No. 52 tungkol sa tourism. Simulan natin. Number one, the sub-technical working group of foreign nationals shall be reconstituted to sub-technical working group on travel. Number two, the suspension of non-essential travel by Filipinos is hereby lifted. All travel restrictions relative to outbound travel of Filipinos are likewise lifted. Number three, the non-essential travel of Filipinos shall be subject to the following conditions. First, submission of confirmed round-trip tickets for traveling on tourist visas. Second, adequate travel and health insurance to cover rebooking and accommodation expenses if stranded and hospitalization in case of infection in such amount as may be determined by the Department of Tourism. Third, allowed entry by the destination country in accordance with their travel, health, and quarantine restrictions. Fourth, execution of a declaration acknowledging the risk involved in traveling, including risk of delay in the return trip to be provided for in the check-in counters by the airlines. Five, upon return, follow the guidelines of returning overseas Filipinos of the National Task Force. Ang masasabi ko sa resolution number 52 ay good news ito para sa tourism industry sapagkat pwede ka na ngayong magbiyahe. Pangalawa, isa sa nakikita ko sa resolution number 52, hindi pa rin dadami ang babiyahe papalabas ng ating bansa or sa ibang mga lugar sapagkat napakahirap magbiyahe. Una, napakamahal niya. Kailangan mo ng malaking halaga para sa iyong insurance, accommodation, at sakasakali, hospitalization budget. Kung pagpunta mo sa bansang gusto mong pasyalan, ay tamahan ka ng COVID. Pero again, overall, this is a welcome news. And hopefully, as we progress uh, sa mga susunod na araw o buwan, lalo pang uh, gumanda ang balita at magluwag ang policy ng ating government para yung dating sigla ng turismo at pagbiyahe sa Pilipinas at sa labas ng bansa ay muli nating maibalik at muli nating maitayo ang ating ekonomiya at muling mabuhay ang mga small businesses na related sa tourism. Magkita ulit tayo sa mga susunod na araw para sa mga mahalagang usapin na may patungkol sa turismo.